Hello, this is Dr. Kraus with Python 4 Engineers Part 4. I want to talk about installing packages in Anaconda. Um, it might be a little weird to cover what's sort of an advanced topic fairly early on, but my students are going to need the Python serial module to go back and forth between Python and an Arduino microcontroller, and so I want to cover this early. Um, it is relatively straightforward, but it does involve using the PowerShell in Windows, which is probably a little bit scary for some. Um, and so basically, uh, first of all, I guess I should back up. How do you know that you would need to do this? If I opened up my Anaconda Navigator, launched a Jupyter Notebook, and tried to import a module, and I was told that the module does not exist, there's an import error, then I would know that I have a package that I've either misspelled or I need to install. And so... That's going to be the case uh, here in just a second. Okay, so I have my Anaconda Navigator open. I'm going to launch my Jupyter Notebook server. That should take just a few seconds. It's going to open a browser to the um, kind of file browser home view. I'm going to create a new Python 3 notebook. So in here, if I were to type import serial and hit shift enter, it says module not found error, no module named serial. So that would be my clue that unless I misspelled that, which I didn't, I have to install it. And so like I said, I need to find the PowerShell. And so search for that application. And then assuming that I know the name, okay, let's say if I didn't know the name, I could kind of search for serial because if I tried to do conda install serial, it would turn out that that doesn't work because that's not the correct name. It tells me that the package name is PySerial, and I've got some different versions that I can be aware of. So if I said conda install PySerial, that should work. It's going to go out and it's going to find the packages that meet that request. It's going to tell me something about their version numbers. And then if everything goes smoothly, it's going to give me a default of yes. So I'm just going to hit enter. And that's just going to work, um, assuming that I have write permissions to the foundational folder that uh, my site packages in Python go to. If that were not the case, it would come back with some kind of error message, and we'll talk about how to deal with that in a minute. Now, if that worked correctly, if I come back over here and I hit Shift-Enter again, I now have serial and it imports correctly. So conda install and then the package name, assuming you know the module name, should go smoothly. If you don't know the module name, as I demonstrated, use conda search and then some kind of pattern out here after a space for what you want to search for. And if you don't have write permissions in the main anaconda folder, then you're going to have to find out what that root folder is and then deal with Windows security or become an administrator or something to give whoever's trying to run the conda install command needs to have write permission to that folder. Um, and in some cases, that's going to require unhiding a hidden folder. And so you'll have to right click on a folder and go to its options or something to view hidden folders um, so that you can then right click on the folder and then get to its security and permission options. So if you don't know what your root conda installation folder is, come back here to um, the IPython notebook, import sys, and then look at sys.path. And the main thing we're trying to say is kind of whatever the whatever the longest path is that occurs that's common to most of these. So in this case, it looks like that's C colon Anaconda 3 um, is likely your root Python path. And most of my packages are going to go in lib colon site packages. So for example, if I were to go to C colon Anaconda 3 lib site packages, I would expect to see a serial folder and then I would know that it installed into the right place. So hopefully that's helpful. Um, like I said, if it turns out that you look at import sys.path and this is some folder that's either hidden or that you don't have write permissions to, then that explains why you can install packages and there's really nothing Python can do until Windows gives Anaconda user person the permission to write to that folder. Thanks.